Hello everyone, this is a video um, about my ARC notebooks uh, from Stables. Um, there's been some chatter about ARC lately, among at least in, in Twitter, uh, with some of the Filofax uh, community members. Um, I, I think it in part is because um, that really nice gentleman, um, I, I don't remember his name, I, um, I think it's Neil. Um, well, he did. He posted two videos this week about the arc um, compared to Filofax, and he's talking with his daughter, and they're going through the different components and just, you know, having some coffee and talking about the the system. Um, I don't remember really what his name is, but um, I'm sorry about that. But I think that's why it it kind of came up in among some of them, some of the Filofax community members that were talking about it. Um, so I figured, hey, I have ARC notebooks, and I really enjoy them, and I, I think they're a, a great system. So I figured I'd film a video about mine. Now, this one that I have, um, I only I have two in the half size, so um, they fit paper that's uh, 8.5 by 5.5 or something like that. I, I'm sorry, I don't really remember the page, but you know, it's a half size of a letter size paper. Anywho, um, uh, I have one in with the plastic cover, which is the one that I, I originally bought, um, and um, it's a really nice system. It's um, very affordable, and um, if you're looking for a notebook system that you can customize and, um, you know, do great things with, I would really recommend this um, to anyone. Now, uh, as a side note, uh, Amy from Twitter alerted me about the fact that uh, Staples in the U.S., has the notebooks, just the notebooks, 50% uh, off. I think that ends today, and today is November 10, 2012. So the 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 plastic cover and the leather covers are 40% off, which is a really good buy because, um, um, for example, I have this one that's a leather, it's a red. I paid... I got it on sale too when I bought them, but this originally is like fifteen dollars, and I think the large size is like twenty dollars. So you're going to be saving forty percent of of that. So if you're looking to buy one, rush, rush to Staples today and um, and get it. <laughs> Not that I'm enabling or anything. Anyways, back to the notebook itself. This one I have set up as my uh, home management binder. Um, keep in mind, I don't have any children. The only child that I have is a four-year-old pug, and it's just my husband and I and my pug. So um, this is what I have set up that works for me, for my family. Um, you probably will need something, a, a different setup if you have children or um, you know you have a lot of responsibilities or a lot of appointments and meetings and committees and things in your life. Um, I do not have any of those things, so um, that's my disclaimer. Anywho, um, up front I have a plastic pocket that I got from Staples, um, which I punched, and I'll talk about that in just a little bit. I punched, I have pens in here, I have my checkbook, I have some stickers, some stamps, and a calculator. Um, and it just keeps it nice and neat on top of the cover. Now, this page right here is just me doodling about trying to figure out how I was going to set up this whole thing. Uh, these tabs that you see here are from the ARC system. You can get them. They're really cheap. I think they're like 3 or $4, and this is hard plastic that's going to last you forever. Now, my tabs are Calendar, Finances, Casa Morris. Then I have a blank one, which I don't know what I'm going to put in there yet, and People. So, what I have here is, this is a full calendar, planning calendar for 2013. So, there you go. And then I have a month on two pages from November 2012 until December 2013. Now, I got these templates from a website called Donna 
young.org and you can print them for free and they're half size so that's perfect um, and then I mean bills birthdays you have a to-do list over here and some note space on the bottom I don't know how to print on both sides I just gave that up it doesn't matter I can use this blank space for notes or whatever I need now in the finances I also printed these from DonnaYoung.org um, it this is just like a a grid to keep your bills you have a date column a name column a check mark and then paid uh, this is just I'm just gonna write bills in here what needs to get paid when how much check it off when it's done good to go and then you have a space for the month up here now um, Casa Morris I'm sorry guys I mean there's nothing in here yet I just set this up like a couple days ago um, this is the arc paper which is excellent um, and it's heavy paper I, I would think it would take wet ink very well um, I I use gel pens or you know like uh, you know gel pens so it holds up very well this is just to put any um, here I'm just gonna keep notes on the house or projects or things we want to do for the house and things like that this one is the empty tab I have no idea what I'm putting in here and then I have people this is contact sheets um, because I like to have those things written down just in case you need them and your phone dies or something happened you you have the information now I have one two three four five uh, top opening envelopes on the back and guess what these are normal letter size sheet protectors which I cut down washi taped and punched and they're in here and that's great and then I just have some of the um, uh, pocket folders that are set the staple cells for this back here and that's it, it it's not it's nothing to um, cumbersome you know this is what works for us now I do have a leather one I'm not using it currently um, I did buy the bigger rings for it um, let me see if I can show you the difference in ring size and there you go I think these are um, one inch rings this one's nicer because it's got a, a flat pocket some some card pockets in here and then it's got a pen loop with an elastic I don't have anything in here you guys this is just a lot of note paper that I have here and then last but not least I just wanted to show you um, I'm not gonna take it out of the box but this is the punch for the arc system I believe this punch is like $39 um, which seems expensive but if you're lucky and you, you keep track of it you you can get this on sale at some point because I paid $30 instead of $40 for it um, so just be on the lookout or if you really want it just get it because it's heavy duty it's great you can use it and then you can punch anything and everything you want into your book um, and uh, it's it's a great addition. I mean, I I I have a lot of fun with this because you can any paper you like, you can either cut it to size or depending what size notebook you have, and then just punch it, and you can put it in your book. So if you're getting into ARC and you really like it, um, I would say that at some point you would need to get this. Uh, I was lucky enough to get it on sale. Um, so be on the lookout for that now um, this system is really good um, it's, it's, it's very well priced and I do recommend it um, you know it's easily sourced you can get it at your local staples and um, they have some pretty neat things that you can do with it so here's my entire haul well not haul but um, uh, collection and um, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.